Hey everybody, I'm Louie. I'm a motorcycle gear expert here at Jaffram. Welcome to our closer look at the Speed & Strength SS 1300 helmet, available at Jaffram.com. The SS 1300 is the next rank up from the SS 1100 in Speed & Strength's motorcycle helmet chain of command. It has an intermediate oval head form, is DOT and ECE rated, and is constructed using the same ATPA or Advanced Thermal Poly Alloy Shell found in other helmets in the ranks. The shield technology is also the same as far as the material used and optical correctness. The attachment system though is completely new. SS has developed a new lockdown shield security system. The main improvement with this system is that the base plates are spring loaded. This pulls the shield in against the gasket for a far better seal. This shield also has a locking mechanism to keep the shield down at high speed or when checking your blind spot. The shield removal is a little tricky and definitely cannot be done without taking the helmet off. To remove the shield, manipulate this little red slide to the forward position. Twist this dial and remove it from the helmet. Repeat the procedure on the other side. And once the dials are removed, pull the shield away from the base plates. Now, I learned a little trick for reinstalling this shield. Most helmet shields need to be installed in the raised position. And with this helmet, if you line up the mechanism and close the shield, the springs will hold the shield tight to the gasket and hold the shield in place while you reinstall the dials. This gives you an extra hand to hold the helmet. The only aspect of this shield that I don't love is the new system doesn't allow you to just have the shield cracked open. The first detent has the shield open halfway, and this is okay for a parking lot, but you couldn't really go over about 35 or so without the turbulence being blinding. A fair trade though to have the spring-loaded base plates to hold the shield against the gasket. Let's take a look at the venting. The chin vent flows air to the shield to prevent fogging, and the chimneys are easily opened and closed with these low-profile switches. The air is channeled directly to the head, then led to the rear of the helmet by the channels in the EPS liner. Low pressure, called the Venturi effect, draws the moist hot air out of the back of the helmet. The vents down here near the bottom are unfortunately fakers, but they do add a little detail to the helmet. The SS 1300 is fitted with yet another of Speed & Strength's wonderful cool core, removable, washable, and moisture wicking liners. The detail on this liner is fantastic. The chin curtain is extra deep and has a soft spandex feel to the hem to eliminate any irritation. The cheek pads are easily removable and the material is very comfortable against your skin, even when wet and mashed up against a beard. The SS 1300 of course has the super easy to use quick release chin strap system. Once the system is properly installed, all you have to do is slide the tab into the ratchet system in your riding. To unhook, simply pull on the red tab and you're free. Thank you for joining me for this closer look at the Speed & Strength SS 1300 motorcycle helmet. For more info on different graphics and colorways or to look at other Speed & Strength products, click on the link below to go to our website. You can also check out our other videos on our YouTube channel, Jaffram Videos. Remember, when it comes to our customers, we'll ride the extra mile. I'm Louie, and we'll see you next time.